Ah. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the pinnacle of weird. The master, the omega, the beginning and the end. No, that's Jesus. This is beyond the weirdest game that's ever been created. Um, I shouldn't say that. It's what made me fall in love with weird games was this game. It was the first game I played where I was like, yep, weird games, I'm into that now. It's called Gentle Moon 2. The first time I played it was on the show on Parker Plays and it just woke me, okay? Hashtag woke. Oh man, just from the title screen, you know this is gonna be a quite an adventure for the both of us. And I like this little penguin right here, the waving at us. I don't know if that's a bow tie or a rash, either way, I'm fine with it. Press space to stop waiting. <laughs> Already, I'm just like, ah, I love this. Now I pick my appearance. Um, Santa hat, afro, it's just like a black hole. Fancy mustache, a bro fist mustache, of course. Well, there's no Parker mustache here either, so I guess they understand. All right, let's go for a classic afro mustache situation. Continue, here we go. Hello. Press space to continue. This might look like your house, but it's not. <laughs> you broke in. It's gentle. Gentle like, like everything in this world. Ah, very gentleman, very yes. I wish I had a top hat right now. I feel very left out. You know, it's fancy when even the flowers have top hats. Mm, yes. A gentle sip. In the world, there are no other worlds. Anyway, <laughs> there's a zombie apocalypse in this game. <laughs> but don't worry, I'll help you. To survive, you could, uh, you, um, let me think. Oh, I, I know. Let's fly to the moon. So the first thing, go and get your spinning Christmas tree. Classic. Okay, so this is, oh, goodness gracious. Here is me, and is there any way to turn off the music, or we're just... We're in it. We just got the music. I can't change the music because I have no way of exiting out of the game. If I... I'm hitting every button. There's no... <laughs> there's no way to escape the game. Well, looks like I'm stuck in here forever now. So I need to find myself a spinning Christmas tree to get on my adventure. Oh, this game. It's just so perfect. All right, here we are at this amazing little section. <laughs> Hello, sir. I don't know if I should be terrified or if I should be bowing down to you. I go ahead and take the spinning Christmas tree. Great, great. You'll need to protect yourself from the zombies. Let's go to the gun store. The gun store is just called guns. So I have my spinning Christmas tree. Why? Oh, man. One thing I'm wondering, did he have edits to this game? Like, did he have ideas where he's like, hmm, didn't make the cut. You know what I mean? Was it like a spinning salt shaker? And then he's like, you know what? Spinning Christmas tree's better. Top hat cinema, very classy. Gentle Mart, the workers there are actually very aggressive, ironically. And I'm looking for the gun store. Hello, sir. I live in Texas right now, so this is pretty common for me. So I just go ahead. You need a better weapon. Um, I can go past, go past the guns, the weapons that I need. Let me go up this giant mountain. Hello, Rushmore. I'm going very quickly. All right, and <laughs> hello, Mr. Penguins. <laughs> Chair rendering apple pie. A pie that shoots chairs. Oh, hungry? Let's go get the bananas. Excellent. All right, so now I have a pie that shoots chairs and I can just see you later, Jimmy. Yeah, take this. No, literally, it's a pie that shoots exploding uh -huh. chairs. Guys, I told you to buckle up on the ride, okay? We're not buckling up for safety. We're buckling up for sanity. All right, so where do we go now? We need to go find the fireworks. Um, over by the bananas. Right, we gotta go get bananas. I got this. Great for potassium, dude. As Cam would say. <gasps> a wild penguin appears. Uh, I wanna play checkers, he says. Okay, penguins don't know how to play checkers. <laughs> you win. And that's it. The game developer was like, this uh, section is getting a little boring. How about we splice it up? Uh, gentle mart, yes. Oh, goodness gracious. <laughs> it was so sweet and innocent. That thing is legitimately terrifying. Holy cow, I hate you. Please leave. Oh, now he's taking a nice little nap. There we go. Unfortunately, you don't have any money. It's a zombie apocalypse, dude. Well, you can sit here and play the guitar. Maybe someone will give you the money because of your amazing guitar performance. I don't know if you've seen me play guitar, but um, people would probably pay me to stop. Go nuts. <laughs> Just going crazy. Oh, gosh. Thank you. Thank you for $70,000 worth of gold. I appreciate you. Just not, just not gonna question it. You got the money. Go ahead and buy these delicious bananas. Okay, so now I can buy some bananas. Hello, sir. Anyone want some bananas? I mean, that's me. I'd like some bananas, please. Okay, so I gotta walk through. I like this Christmas. <laughs> that actually scared me. Oh, man. 
There's a lot of very old men. Wait, hold on. There's only penguins and old men and zombies. This whole world is just full of that. Oh, man. I think I'd rather be a zombie. Look at this. Jeez Louise. That's nightmares, dude. I don't know what kind of male pattern baldness that is. Maybe, I think someone just shaved him. No, it can't be. There are no bananas. Don't panic. We can go to the other town. Okay, they must have bananas. <laughs> you need a car to get there. Okay, go to the comics kiosk and don't ask me why. All right, let's get ourselves over to the, the kiosk. You want some comics? And you don't have any money? Okay, bring me the helmet of my favorite superhero, Trash Man. <laughs> oh, the classic. Then I'll give you the comics. Great, excellent. I think what I do, right? Hello, sir. Do you know anything about Trash Man? There it is. I grab the helmet of Trash Man, and then I give it to, um... You found the helmet of Trash Man. It fits perfectly. Oh, good. I'm so glad. And smells so good, too. You'll find your comics in the basement behind my store. That sounds like a trap. If someone asks you to grab a trash can to wear it as a helmet, and then tells you to go in a basement, that's when you call the police. Okay, so I'm just gonna... Avoid all instincts and wise decisions and go in this terrifying basement. It's fine. I got a weapon. I got a pie that shoots chairs. And I also have this Christmas tree. All right. Picked up a comic book. Okay, great. Now you need now you, now you need some magic. We'll pull out a car out of your comic book with magic. Awesome. Wait, okay. I got to go find magic so that I can f make a car come out of a comic book to go get bananas at the... Is bananas this important? I think I found the magic. That has to be the giant magic castle over there. You literally look like a, a piece of beef. Yeah, no, get away from me. Get away, get away. Get away from me, beef men. Yeah. Okay, so we found the magic store. Let me go up here and... Hello, sir. Oh, you look handsome as ever. Can I, can I explode you? Nope, nope. Why is everyone chair resistant? I don't like it. <laughs> that was easy. Wow, you made a car. <laughs> now you can drive to the other town to get those precious bananas. All right, got myself um what I think is a car, I guess. All right, let's let's hop in, shall we? Eat to get in the car. Excellent. Now I can I can drive around. This is pretty cool. Off roading, boys. Okay, so here's the other town. Oh goodness gracious. Gentle march. Ah, charge. <laughs> <laughs> oh goodness, it's fine if I park there, right? If you don't give me bananas, I'm gonna be real upset, dog. All right, give it to me. Yeah, finally, bananas are ours. You need to fly to the moon somehow. Okay, so let's borrow the sleigh from Santa. Okay, and then just gonna get my car out of here. I got my bananas. Oh no, oh no, did I break everything? Oh goodness, I might have gotten it stuck in here. Guys, is there a AAA in this game? All right, I'll be honest with you. Straight up got my car stuck in here, so I'm just gonna leave this here for now. Um. Oh, jeez! Oh, no! <laughs> that literally scared me so bad! I am very sad I broke my car. This is gonna take so long. Okay, Santa. Hello, sir. Wait a minute. It's not even winter right now, dude. What is he doing like March? There's Santa, apparently. <laughs> and there's just a penguin chilling on top of Santa. He keeps him warm. There we go. We need more power to those sledges. I think you can use the main engine of the factory. A totally not scary mannequin factory. Excellent. I'm really sad I broke my car. A totally not scary mannequin factory. Yes, I'll just go ahead and- Ah! You lied to me. Why do you have a mannequin factory? How many mannequins do you need? Oh, oh goodness. Oh, yeah, no, I really don't like this at all. Who buys this many mannequins? I picked up the engine. Okay, I just put it in my pocket real quick, and now I gotta get out of the mannequin factory as fast as I possibly can. All right, back to fun times. All right, got my engine, and... Oh, oh goodness gracious, go away. Oh, I hate it. Leave. Oh, zombies. Oh, goodness. Okay, so I got my engine, and now we need what? We need to get some good music for my trip to the moon. Okay, great. Go to the disco. Nice. Oh, what's up, buddy? I even got an afro, too. Can I dance with you? I can only jump, but hey, that's that's something, right? Yeah, disco's fun. Hello. You need some good music. Sure, let's get rid of those zombies, eh? Oh, they do a pretty good Michael Jackson thriller dance, I'll be honest, though. Great, you're almost ready to go to the moon, but not yet. You need a TV. You gotta watch those Parker Plays episodes, huh? Go to the cinema. Okay, great. I'm gonna get my cinema, and then I'm off. I don't even know why I'm fleeing to the moon. I feel like the zombie apocalypse is pretty much handled. I have a bunch of chairs. In fact, I have infinite chairs. I can just kill all the zombies, but now nah, I'll just go to the moon instead. Cool. The cinema screen will be your TV. There's one thing left. You need to breathe when you're on the moon. Yeah, genius. You need a protective suit. Nah, just take the aquarium from your house. It's gonna be okay. Time to visit my old house. Hello, kittens. 
All right, so I got my aquarium and I just put it on my head. Aquariums are full of water. Ah, just never question it. Oh my goodness, where did I get this bear? What is happening? And time to go to the moon. To the moon we go. Yes. The gentle moon, that is. Yes. And that's it. That's the whole game. That's that's the whole game of Gentle Moon. What did you just watch? I don't know. Did you enjoy it? Who knows? Did you leave a like? You better. Thank you for watching the masterpiece that was Gentle Moon, and we'll see you guys in the next weird video. Yo, that it, that it.